Welcome to Aftershock 300's World Tour, Episode 3. We're still here at the castle from Episode 2. But um, today I'm going to show you some stuff that's not near as good as this. But it was all built before Creative Mode came out. So that's why it's not near as good. Okay, I'm just going to show you this. It's a whole city made of crosses. Everything's in the shape of a cross. It's not even close to f finishing. But I um made it before creative mode. That's why it's really cool. As I said, I did the modding with the glitches for the um, duplication. That's why I have so much, so much gold here. It's not definitely not legit. There's not that much gold in the game. Okay, is it nighttime? Because if it is, I'm going to bed. No! Okay. Fine, I don't want the rain to be here, but... It's Xbox Edition, so I can't turn them off. The roof for the first building. First one I built of the city. Second one is not near as cool, but it's still a little building. This uh, diamond one over here has a ton of doors. I don't know why I put so many doors on here. I guess I was just in the mood for a lot of, a lot of doors. Okay. So that's the cross city. Except for this one, I didn't show you this building. This building took forever to do because I didn't have flying or anything. So I was building it while standing on it and stuff. Okay. First floor. It's like a two room cutoff section. And uh, second floor is up here. It actually walks down into it. That's pretty cool, I thought. And the third floor has double doors leading to it. It's pretty cool. Now another thing, you see how this is kind of flat and cut off, it does not look natural at all, that's because it's not, it used to take up all the way over to about here, where it was a mountain, and I had to remove it block by block with a shovel, and then over here it doesn't look natural because that was all beach and I filled it all in, <laughs> block by block. Um, this was the first thing I made for it, the big path leading up, and the uh, big cross, it's like the whole thing for it. This is where I kept all my stuff, bunch of pickaxes, bunch of dirt and cobblestone from when I was mining stuff. See this entire chest is full of dirt, basically. That this is really cool, but uh yeah. There's no really rooms right now. It's just levels. Okay. Oh, I didn't put the glass back. Okay, well. So there's glass here now, <laughs> and it's just kind of a lookout. Whoops, controller. Batteries are dying on this thing, I gotta go replace them. Oh, they're not on here either. Yeah. Okay. Now you'll see, everything looks like a cross when you're up here. It's really cool. See, they're all in the shape of crosses. That one was very difficult, but yeah, that was pretty cool. So that is my my cross city. That was gonna take a little longer than this. It's only been three and a half minutes, so I might as well go show you something else. This is not near done, but it's my Hunger Game map. Right now, I'm only working on the wall. It's not very high, and yes, it's made of bedrock. I know people are like, "Oh gosh, it's horrible," because you can't see through it. But yeah. Okay, that's this, and it's going to surround this entire area here. It's just a bunch of little cluster, <laughs> cluster of islands. That's going to be the Hunger Game map, because I don't know what else to put on the cluster of islands. It's going to go out here a little bit. Surround this entire place. And I think it's going to cut back around, like, right here. Yeah, there it is. And then connect. And then... I already started on the cornucopia, but it's kind of just a marker right now on where it's going to be. Right here is where it's going to be. I'm going to level out these mountains and uh, fill in that water, and that'll be the cornucopia. Okay, well that's all, since it was a very short episode, but that is all for Aftershock 300's World Tour Episode 3. Bye.